My name's Luke and I'm an amateur trail builder. I've spent endless hours out here building my dream mountain bike trail. And it's pretty f***ing unique. Today, we're going to take you down one of the most unusual trails you've ever seen. We'll find out how difficult it is to ride, and to finish it all off, I'll race Luke down his own mountain biking masterpiece in a full top to bottom run. Luke has built five mega features on his trail, and he's keen to share his creations with us today. Through the top of the trail, I can't believe it, man. I'm gonna take Froth down to check out the first feature on the trail, which is also my latest build. I'm so excited. <laughs> Oh, here it is, mate. <laughs> so this is the whale tail. It's the first feature on the trail and it's meant to be just fun and playful, a bit more chill. The chicken bridges are awesome because you can make it a bit more intense if you want. I want to hit it with the chicken bridge first. And then we'll pop these off. It's better to be safe than sorry. Yeah? Let's roll into it and see how it goes. The wooden whale tail is super fun and forgiving, but it's time to go from beginner mode to expert mode. Old mate's contemplating hitting it without the chicken bridges for the first time. Just turned a fun feature into a really nasty one. I reckon he's got this. Mad dude. Fully like it's a fun feature. I guess I need to hit it because I've only hit it once without the chicken bridges. <laughs> Dude, you've got it. Yes, dude! As much as we want to keep riding Luke's wild tail, we still have four more unique features to ride today. I'll follow you down to the next feature. You're not gonna miss it. Just make sure you come to a stop. Don't hit the drop. But sometimes when you're having a mad time on the trail, oh, it's really on. hard to hit the brakes. Oh, he's just hit it. Oh my God. Well, now I look like an idiot because I didn't hit it. I should have just hit it. Two out of five. This was the first major feature on the trail and it was the biggest drop I'd ever hit at the time. So I was pretty nervous. I like it how these move. Added spice. Should we hit it? Together. Don't, don't leave me behind this time. Right, we are two features down. Luke's got me a bit nervous because he told me this is one of his biggest creations yet. Oh my god. Man, you are a bloody lunatic. <laughs> this is it, man. The Dunny Drop. So Frost asking how much speed you need for this thing. A lot of speed is the answer. I've never ridden anything like this, so it's pretty unique. It's different, dude. It's very different. Pretty sure I'm just overthinking it. What makes this unique and a challenge is this 270 degree berm that goes uphill that you have to send it off. Like it's probably hard to tell on camera, but that berm, that's right there. Yeah, yeah. Like you land and you're on that. Imagine if you knuckled and you got a weird bounce or whatever, you just went over the back of the berm, over I those trees. prefer not to think about that dude, but thank you. It's always a possibility, mate. Look what happened to me. Is this it? Drop it! Oh. 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 Yeah! Ew. Oh. Trail under construction. That timber berm is so sick. Currently it just sort of goes to nowhere after that, but I'm milling a lot of timber so we can continue. Nice big wooden roller coaster all the way down and join up with the rest of the trail down through the trees there. It's gonna be sick. Oh, I don't think you've ever released that information before, have you? Oh, you've heard it here first, <laughs> mate. I wanna hit it faster. He needs to hit it faster. <laughs> Oh, Jesus! 
good. <laughs> you just have so much fun you don't want to stop. Oh mate. my god. That's three features down and two to go. And don't forget, we still have a full top to bottom run to do. So what's this next feature called, mate? The cannon. Ah, oh, all right, all right. It's the bone log, mate. <laughs> the bone log. These things are always bigger in person. I reckon I might tow him into this because he's a bit concerned about the speed. I tell him. I can't believe he's only just asking me now if I'd like a tow. I love a tow. Just go fast and you can't you can't go wrong. Maybe he can go wrong. What are you concerned? Like you reckon. But it's the rock wall, all right? It's intimidating. Yeah, look, if you hit that rock wall, you've done something really wrong. But you've hit the rock wall. You, you'll be fine. All right. We're off and Cut laps, that was another sick feature. That's four out of five done, mate. I'm pretty sure I have this in the bag. <laughs> mate, you look great on my bone eye, but I've got a special one for you down here. All right, so you got a little step down and then it's your choice on the feature. We'll see which one you choose. Send it. How's that? Sent that. No, you didn't, mate. You can go way deeper. You can almost land on the bridge. Well, you better show me how it's done then. Oh, that was big. All right, that's how you send it. After session in the awesome gully drop, Luke gives us the backstory on his next bizarre feature. One night, this tree fell down in a storm, and I was like, well, I'm be stupid not to turn that into a sketchy, skinny bridge. So I was out here with a chainsaw, and, and here it is. Now I've got to ride it. The hardest part of this feature actually is the turn onto it. Once you've done that, it's smooth sailing across it. Just don't end up in the drink, mate. What do you call it, Leech Creek? You were standing down there, you probably got leeches all over your ankles. No way. Oh, it's a leech. Is that a leech? Ah! Oh. Yuck! Ah, oh, yuck! Ooh. Oh, oi! Yuck, dude. No, go away, man. You could have told me that before I was standing in the leech pit. Bro. I knew you wouldn't have got the shot. <laughs> dude! <laughs> Bro, they're so disgusting, man. You were foaming at the mouth there. <laughs> oh, sh**! <laughs> Shut up, dude. You serious or what? Bro, is that on my back, dude? Yeah. Don't. I'm not going back in there, dude. You can put your own cameras there. Get the ABGBs, you know? And that's why we call it the leech pit. <laughs> Don't fall in the leech pit, mate. Oh, no. This was the fifth major feature on Luke's trail to conquer. And to be honest, besides the massive amounts of leeches, I'm feeling pretty confident I can defeat Luke on his own creation. Oh my god! Oh wow. Hey, this guy thinks he can keep up with me on my own trail. I built this trail. You won't even calm <laughs> down this area now. There's leeches here, mate. I'll take the skinny any day. Wait, that is a leech in here. Get f turn around. Dude, don't. Holy crap. Are you serious, bro? Get it, get this. Oh shit, it's on your neck. Ah! I told you that something was crawling around in my hair and you told me that I was overreacting. <laughs> this joint, let's go. <laughs> he legit you. just had a leech in his hair. After another slimy setback, we head back to the top of the trail for the moment we've all been waiting for. We're about to do a full top to bottom run and I'm going to see if I can keep up the creator of this track. Mr. Carlapps, you look ridiculous. What's going on here? Hey, this is a sick new camera angle and I reckon we'll be able to get some good shots if you can keep up with me. I'm gonna leave you in my dust. <laughs> Where you going? Dropping snake run. This bit of the trail is still under construction and we are back on. Oh my god! No, no, no. 
You can have the wage pit. I'm a little bit traumatized still. It's definitely the most unique trail I've ever ridden. And uh, thanks for having me, mate. Hopefully do more in the future. Yes, yeah, super. Let us know in the comments what your favorite feature was. And if you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button for more. Luke's trail is on private property, so unfortunately it's not open to the public. But you can watch him craft his amazing trail on his YouTube channel. I'll leave a link down below. Cheers.